Today we meet to talk about context clues. Now there is a magnifying glass. It is telling you to look at a word closely, like really closely. So closely that you know what the big picture says about the word and you understand a new word. So look in surrounding sentences when you look closely at a word. And look in the paragraphs too. Let's apply this knowledge. So here we have an unfamiliar word, a Renaissance man. You know what the word man means. So we have to figure out the meaning of the unfamiliar word Renaissance. Let's look at the first clue. It's a sentence clue. It says, could do it all. It is a man who could do it all. Let's look at another clue. It says he designed and invented a wide range of objects. Now, here in the last paragraph, it says what Leonardo da Vinci invented and designed. Look at the range. Parachute, helicopter, tank, repeating rifle, swinging bridge, and motor car. Leonardo da Vinci was a man who could do so much. So we get a meaning of the word, which is a person who has deep knowledge of more than one field. It is because he could do so much, could design so much, that he had a knowledge of more than one field. Leonardo da Vinci was a Renaissance man. Let's find out more. The clue is he had talent in many fields. So look at this one. In the first paragraph, it says, he was also a scientist, mathematician, engineer, and a costume maker. Leonardo da Vinci had talent in so many fields. So another meaning of Renaissance man is a person who has skills in more than one field. So this passage is cool. It gives you an unfamiliar word, Renaissance man, and it gives you sentence clues and paragraph clues to tell you so much about the word. I 